Before we dive into the assertion, it's essential to initially comprehend what atomic fuel pedals really are. The Huge Hadron Collider, LHC, worked by CERN, is a 17-mile ring made out of superconducting magnets. It remains as the world's biggest and most momentous iota smasher, addressing the zenith of human accomplishment. Truth be told, it is so strong that it can reproduce the exact states of the universe's most memorable moments. Anyway, could the machine that plans to uncover the secrets of the universe possibly hold the way to something truly unique? Founded in 1954, CERN is one of the most famous research institutions worldwide, with 23 member nations and numerous researchers. It serves as a hub for collaboration and innovation. While the LHC is CERN's primary project, it is just a part of a vast network of fuel pedals and exploratory investigations. This framework is designed not so much for engines or people but rather for subatomic particles in a long-term hardship and the actual fabric of space itself. The LHC speeds up protons near the speed of light, guiding them into a crash course that reflects the energy released during the Big Bang. These impacts produce temperatures far hotter than the sun's core. A huge array of magnets coordinates the protons on their way, while complex cooling systems maintain the magnets at temperatures lower than space. The beams in the LHC are made to crash at four distinct locations across the accelerator ring, working with four specific particle detectors. Mapbook, CMS, ALICE, and LHCB. Everyone has a unique function, focusing on different aspects of particle physics. Together they act as colossal cameras, capturing pictures of these crashes. Researchers then analyze the resulting particles, looking for indications of the elusive Higgs boson, otherwise known as the God particle, and other anomalies that could shed light on the fundamental workings of the universe. By focusing on the tiny, we open insights into the macrocosmic world. Yet with each answer new questions emerge. With each discovery, another challenge surfaces. The LHC isn't simply a scientific tool. It is an image of human curiosity and progress. It represents our persistent quest for understanding and our desire to unlock the key forces that govern our universe. However, as we stretch the boundaries of our knowledge, we must also confront deeper existential questions. What dangers lie in testing the unknown? Might our pursuit of knowledge ever inadvertently release forces unchangeable for us? Inside CERN, where the limits of human comprehension are continually extended, a chilling discovery has surfaced making even the most experienced researchers stop. Brian Cox, a former CERN researcher and a leading voice in the domain of particle physics, recently shared a statement that has both fascinated and disturbed the world. His words resonated with disturbing clarity. The purpose of CERN's LHC is to mimic a small Big Bang. Yes, you heard correctly, a miniature version of the very event that birthed our universe. The physicist also elaborated on the implications of this goal highlighting the LHC's vast potential to make pivotal discoveries, including uncovering the secrets of the Higgs boson and delving into the cryptic universe of dark matter, which comprises a significant part of the universe. Imagine grasping the power of creation, the ability to gather the very essence of the universe. It's an exciting possibility but one full of risk. The mini Big Bang isn't a theoretical concept. It's a tangible reality within the LHC. The extreme temperatures, pressures, and raw energy recreate the conditions present at the dawn of the universe. It's like standing on the precipice of written history, witnessing the commencement of existence itself. Yet, with such power comes great responsibility, and the pressing question remains, what if something goes wrong? In fact, something did go wrong in 1978. Russian physicist Anat Borsky experienced an accident that could forever change his life. While working at the U-70 synchrotron at the Institute for High Energy Physics in Pino, Russia, a breakdown caused a proton beam to hit him. The beam, with unimaginable force, passed through his skull, entering the back of his head and leaving through his nose. His experience was startling. He saw a flash brighter than 1,000 suns but had no immediate concerns. The proton path left behind a trail of destruction, burning tissue and bone. Yet, remarkably, he remained conscious and even walked to seek treatment. The result was disturbing yet surreal. The proton beam caused localized tissue damage, 
leading to partial hearing loss in one ear and facial paralysis on one side. Strikingly, Borsky's mental capabilities remained unaffected, and he continued his career in medicine. This incident serves as a stark reminder of the immense power and potential dangers inherent in particle accelerators. The risks associated with machines like the LHC should be acknowledged with a sober mind. The possibility of catastrophic reactions, where the very fabric of life is altered, is not the stuff of science fiction, but a real concern voiced by respected scientists. One of the most frightening and captivating issues surrounding the LHC's experiments is the potential creation of a small black hole. Black holes are regions in space where gravity is so intense that even light can't escape. These cosmic vacuum cleaners devour stars and are mysterious entities hidden in the shadows of our universe. The possibility that the LHC could produce one of these phenomena, even on a limited scale, is both fascinating and unsettling for the public and scientists alike. Could this black hole grow uncontrollably and eventually consume the Earth from within? Scientists have reassured the public that any black hole created by the LHC would be unstable and would vanish very quickly. Still, the mere possibility of such an event has sparked debates, fears, and wonder at the power humanity wields. It's important to understand how the LHC could create a black hole. The answer lies in the basic mechanics of particle accelerators. When protons crash at near-light speed, the energy produced is immense enough to warp the very fabric of space-time. Imagine a trampoline stretched tight and then a heavy object is dropped onto it. The fabric bends, and if the object is heavy enough, it creates a well deep enough to draw anything nearby into it. This serves as an analogy for what could happen inside the LHC. In the realm of quantum physics, where the laws of the universe are often strange and dramatic, a theory exists suggesting that there may be additional dimensions hidden within our world. If these dimensions do exist, the LHC's experiments could tap into them, creating a gravitational well that forms a small black hole. This unusual interaction of particles has even caught the attention of prominent scientists, including the late Stephen Hawking. In his writings, Hawking warned of the potential dangers of the Higgs boson at very high energy levels. Such instability could lead to a catastrophic event known as vacuum decay, an event that wouldn't destroy the Earth, but could potentially annihilate the entire universe. The renowned cosmologist and physicist Sir Martin Rees has also voiced concerns about CERN's investigations. In his book Our Last Hour, he explored the risks associated with particle accelerators, including the LHC. His words were cautious, yet filled with existential dread. Rees examined a worst-case scenario in which a failed experiment could trigger a phase transition, rippling through space-time and creating a catastrophe that could engulf the entire universe. However, Rees assigned a low probability to these disastrous outcomes. He argued that even a small risk deserved serious consideration. The stakes are high, and the margin for error is razor-thin. Scientists at CERN have run countless simulations, analyzed theories, and implemented rigorous safety protocols to guarantee the LHC's tasks are essentially as protected as conceivable. Brian Cox himself stressed the significance of these safeguards, recognizing the worries surrounding the LHC's tasks. He consoled the public that the energies involved are well within what the Earth normally experiences, and the possibilities of creating a stable black hole are cosmically low. Regardless of whether a black hole were made, Scientists contend it would be so small and unstable that it would rapidly dissipate, releasing energy in a phenomenon known as Hawking radiation. It would be a short moment of grandiose miracle, a passing glimpse into the void before it disappeared forever. Some have taken this idea even further, estimating that the LHC's trials could open a doorway to another universe or dimension. While this hypothesis is largely dismissed by mainstream scientists, it has caught the imagination of many, becoming a subject of fascination, fear, and myth. What could lie beyond our universe? Might we unconsciously release forces or entities we don't yet understand? The idea of opening a doorway to another realm has even been sensationalized by various news outlets, fueling doubts and fears. But where did this idea start, and what does it mean in terms of scientific inquiry? Hidden dimensions are not new to physics. String theory, a leading candidate for a unified theory of everything, 
suggests there might be more than the standard three dimensions of space and one of time. These additional dimensions could be compactified or hidden from our perception. Nevertheless, under extreme circumstances, they may be present or revealed. Now, imagine the LHC as a gigantic key, opening doors that have been locked since the dawn of history. When protons slam into energy levels never before achieved on Earth, they could, in principle, create ripples that test these hidden dimensions, if they exist. The LHC might uncover them. Yet, before we get too excited about wild theories, it's important to recognize that while the LHC is enormously powerful, there is no conclusive evidence suggesting it will create a path for another universe or, as some fear, lead to damnation itself. Still, the allure of the unknown, combined with the mysterious nature of quantum physics, ensures that these ideas will continue to captivate our collective imagination. Should we be worried about the LHC and its potential dangers? It's easy to get swept up in sensational headlines and fears of global catastrophe. However, the reality is that researchers at CERN are keenly aware of the risks involved. They have taken every precaution to ensure their experiments are safe, continuing to monitor and test their work with absolute attention to detail. The potential rewards of their research, such as breakthroughs in our understanding of the universe, the discovery of new particles, and the exploration of dark matter, are truly remarkable. The LHC showcases human ingenuity and offers a glimpse into the very heart of the universe. However, as with any major scientific advancement, the risks should not be overlooked. We must approach these discoveries with a balance of awe, respect, and caution. The Large Hadron Collider represents the frontier of scientific inquiry, where theoretical physics merges with experimental reality. Its true potential to answer fundamental questions about the universe, such as the origins of matter, mass, and the nature of dark matter, is immense. Yet, despite the rigorous safety measures and extensive simulations, the LHC continues to inspire a sense of mystery and fear in some. The sheer size of the machine and the energy it produces are awe-inspiring, and each new experiment opens pathways to unknown scientific realms. While most scientists remain confident in the safety of LHC experiments, there will always be key uncertainties. What if unforeseen anomalies arise that challenge our understanding of physics and the universe itself? The LHC is pushing the boundaries of human knowledge and testing the limits of our control over the natural world. As particle collisions mimic conditions from the earliest moments of the universe, existential questions about the impact on the fabric of reality grow ever more pressing. The ongoing experiments at the LHC continue to test the limits of human understanding, while the insights they may yield could dramatically expand our understanding of the universe. There's a palpable tension between the quest for discovery and the potential dangers of pushing scientific boundaries. As researchers delve deeper into the mysteries of particle physics, they risk uncovering clues that could alter our very perception of reality. The possibility of unraveling new dimensions, discovering exotic particles, or unlocking the secrets of dark matter presents enormous opportunities, but also potentially strange risks. Could the LHC's experiments someday yield results that we cannot predict or control? Public fascination with the LHC often focuses on its ability to cause catastrophic events or uncover mysteries that could reshape humanity's place in the universe. However, this fascination should not overshadow the careful, meticulous work being done by the researchers involved. Despite the risks that come with high-energy particle collisions, the safety protocols in place are designed to minimize potential dangers. Scientists involved in LHC experiments undergo rigorous training, and the operations of the collider are monitored and reviewed at every step. Yet, the sheer scale of these experiments and their implications often give rise to speculation that extends beyond the realm of science into the domain of legend and conjecture. While shocking ideas of alternate dimensions or parallel universes might fuel media reports, it's important to note that there is no solid evidence suggesting the LHC will open these theoretical gateways. However, it is true that some hypotheses suggest the possibility of multiple dimensions. These ideas remain speculative, and the LHC has yet to provide any definitive proof that it is unlocking such mysteries. The LHC's mission is not to prove these speculations but to investigate the fundamental building blocks of our universe.
Despite the intense scrutiny the LHC faces from both mainstream scientists and the public, it remains one of the most advanced tools we have for understanding the universe at the most fundamental level. The Collider's ability to answer profound, unanswered questions about the origins of matter and the forces that shape the universe is unparalleled. These breakthroughs could lead to advances in technology, medicine, and our overall understanding of the universe that we can scarcely imagine. As scientists continue to probe the subatomic world, they are not just asking questions, they are rewriting the fundamental laws of physics as we know them. As the LHC continues its mission to test the deepest mysteries of the universe, its discoveries have the potential to revolutionize fields far beyond particle physics. For example, a deeper understanding of the Higgs boson could have significant implications for fields like medicine, material science, and computing. The technology developed to handle the massive amounts of data generated by the LHC's experiments has already led to advances in areas such as data storage and cloud computing. These innovations ripple out into everyday life, transforming industries and influencing how we interact with technology. Moreover, the search for dark matter, a mysterious substance believed to account for much of the universe's mass, could change our understanding of cosmology. If scientists can finally identify the particle or particles that make up dark matter, it could open new theories about the universe's structure and provide a clearer picture of the forces that shaped its evolution. Despite the potential for momentous discoveries, the LHC also highlights a fundamental truth. Scientific progress often carries risks. As we continue to unravel the building blocks of our universe, there is always the possibility that we will uncover dangers we did not anticipate. The LHC serves both as a tool for advancing knowledge and as a reminder that our quest for discovery must be tempered with caution and responsibility.